Hello everybody, welcome welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is going to be a cash stuffing. We will be stuffing $500 today. So thanks to you guys, I did get paid from YouTube very well. I did actually get a paycheck of $520. So again, thank you guys so much. This was all thanks to you. And I also did not get a work paycheck this week, which is another reason why I am extremely grateful for this platform and just everything. So we will be stuffing 500 of the income that I did make. Um, I do want to quickly say, though, that my Apple Pencil did die the first time I tried to film this. So we're going to have to go without one today. I'm so sorry about that. But anyway, let's go ahead and sort out our money and just go ahead and get started with this stuffing. So another thing really quick to explain this setup, I am having to film very late at night because of something that happened today that I don't want to speak on quite yet. Um, today's Thursday when I'm filming this and I think it's best to film it when I'm in today's mindset versus waiting till tomorrow when I might not want to film. But anyway, yeah, I'm filming late and so this is the only way I could get the best looking lighting. So we are going to start with my cash envelopes. So first it's going to be gas and we do have $2 left over in here so we're gonna set that to the side and I will show you guys what we're gonna do with that later. So gas is going to be getting just $10 today. So my boyfriend is matching all of my cash envelopes or like my expenses besides spending. They are just staying in his account. So there's $10 in gas. Then we have food, food has $10 extra. So we are gonna pull this out. And again, we'll go through what we're doing with that in a second, but food is going to just be receiving $20. I think as soon as I'm done filming this, we're gonna head to the grocery store. So there's 20 bucks into food. Then we have spending. Spending is just going to be receiving $10. Um, sorry, these are backwards. I did also get these envelopes from the Planning Dancer, if you guys are new and have no idea. But yeah, that is who these are from, and I do actually have a new set coming in the mail. So next is going to be fun. Fun is just gonna be receiving $10. As you guys can see, this one's actually empty for like the first time ever. Um, and that's because we did treat my family to Sonic when we visited the other day. So there's fun all stuffed. So that is all for my cash envelopes and expenses. We're going to go ahead and move over to my bills and savings now. So I keep my bills and savings in this super cute little cap binder. So if you guys are interested in this, it should be linked down below. Um, not quite sure what I have down there. I kind of forget sometimes. So right off the bat, we are going to start with my 100 envelope challenge. So I will be stuffing $11 today. So my boyfriend does Venmo me the cash for this um, directly when he gets paid. Just because it's easier for us to put this in the account where all of the rest of the money is when he Venmo's it. So there is $11. Then we have my phone bill. Phone bill is going to be getting $10, and this should put me at the $50 that I need for the month. So we have $20, $30, $40, and $50 in my phone bill, which is good. That's exactly what I need. So then next we have Best Buy. It's not going to be getting stuffed because I do already have its minimum payment. So we're going to skip Best Buy. Then we have Loans. Loans is going to be getting $11. This is my credit builder loan, which is why... I have money in an envelope because I'm saving up for a bill that I don't want to pay off early because then that defeats the purpose of the purpose of the credit builder loan. So I do want to make a deposit though. I usually deposit a couple months um, payment at a time. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, and 65. So I counted 165, and since my Apple Pencil is not charged right now, I will have to go through and count all these again just to fill out my tracker. So if I did count it wrong, though, just go ahead and let me know down below. Um... Next is going to be 52 weeks. So here's the thing with this. If you guys can see that the arrow that I drew, 52 weeks is going to be stuffed straight into home because that's what I will be using it for. So I did make a deposit of 400 just because it was too much money to have in my college dorm room. So I'm going to pull the extra six out and we will be moving this to home um, when we stuff the rest of this money. So we're going to go ahead and skip this for now. So next is going to be emergency, and emergency will be getting $35. So we have a 20, a 10, and then a 5. Since this is um, a pretty nice bonus check, I decided to choose 
a larger number from my challenge for emergency fund. That way I can get ahead while I am ahead. So emergency fund now has 20, 40, 50, 55, 56, 57, and 58 dollars. So that's super nice. Retirement's going to be getting six dollars because as you guys no, we have been in a lingo between ending with the number four and the number nine. So adding this extra dollar will hopefully even us out. So let's go ahead and add this in here. So retirement now has 50, 100, 20, 40, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, and 60. So we have 160 in retirement. I have already, I think, figured out why I want to open my Roth IRA. So that should be happening fairly soon. Next will be taxes. Taxes is going to be getting 156. So that's a 1, a 50, sorry, a 100, a 50, a 5, and a 1. So I also made a deposit um, for taxes just to kind of keep the 2020 and 2021 year separate, but also for safety because, again, I do live on campus. So it wouldn't be very smart of me to keep large amounts of money in my dorm room. So taxes now has 100. 200, 10, 15, 20, 21, and 22. So we have $222 in my taxes. All of the trackers that you guys see in the envelopes will be filled in um, after I'm done filming this. So next is going to be a new car. New car is going to be getting $25. Um, as you guys probably have noticed, my priority has shifted from new car to my home slash move out. And... Um, it'll be like that for quite a while, I think, at least until we move out. But New Car Store has a good amount. It has 400 in the bank, and in the envelope, we have 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, and 97. So that's a total of 497 in my new car fund. So that is all for my bills and larger savings. We're going to go ahead and go into my sinking funds, which I'm super excited for this because... If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would know that I made myself some new envelopes. However, I originally made them as laminate envelopes and I hole punched them wrong. The vinyl was coming out like trash. It was all a big mess up. So I decided to make them again. But as you guys can see, I did make them on zipper envelopes. So I'm super excited for this whole thing. I think they look super cute. Business will be getting $15. Not only am I trying to save for the 4,000 subscriber giveaway, which thank you guys so much for that. But I do also have to ship an international gift or like giveaway prize. So hopefully not all my money is spent towards there. But anyway, in business we have 10, 20, 25, and 30 dollars, which I think is a pretty good amount. And look at how cute these C envelopes are. I'm super excited to get my envelopes from Jordan because they kind of like go with this whole theme. So next is going to be car maintenance. Car maintenance is receiving just a $10 bill. So let's go ahead and kind of move this in a little bit. So car maintenance is also not a very big priority right now because I think I still have like 3,000 miles till I need another oil change. So we have $10, $15, and $16. My babe also did make a car maintenance envelope since we do share my vehicle. He decided that he would make an envelope that way we can basically split everything. So next is Christmas. It's going to be getting $20 because it did not get stuffed last week and I do give it $10 a week. So we now have $40 bucks into Christmas, which is a pretty good pace for me. Um, I think I can handle $10 a week. So next is going to be holidays and birthdays. So I did get the idea for this envelope um, from Amy L. here on YouTube. Go watch her videos if you don't. I love her. Um, and we are going to be putting $5 in here. So we now have a total of 5, 10, 11, and 12, which is a lot more than I thought we had. So I guess that's good about sinking funds. So next is going to be home. So this is where it's going to kind of get a little bit confusing because I did say I was going to be stuffing my uh, 52 weeks into home. So we have to begin the $6 that were left over my 52 weeks because I made an even deposit of 400, not the whole 406. Then we're also gonna give it the extra $2 from gas. So now to actually stuff it, we're gonna grab the $29. So 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, and 29. So now let's count 
um, all of what home has because it also has some money in its envelope. So as you guys can see, this is a very big priority of mine. Home is going to be for like decor and furniture only and then my move out fund will be like for application admin fees deposits for his grocery trip and stuff like that because the 100 envelope challenge is to be ahead on rent and utilities so you have a bunch of savings going everywhere but it's better to be over prepared than under so home now has 20 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 50 and 51. I'm not sure I counted that right, so I'm going to do it one more time. 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. Okay, see, I knew I messed up somewhere. So there is $41 into home, which is very good. It's a really large jump from what we had last week. So there is home. Then we have my babe. He is just going to be receiving $5 because for Valentine's Day, we decided to just get candy. And I'm totally okay with that because who doesn't want candy? So he now has a total of $10, which I think should pretty much hold me over. So next is going to be Kitty. Kitty is going to be getting $3. You're going to notice that it's a bigger jump from last week because Jordan did give me the money that he had owed this envelope. So... Yeah, it has 50, 70, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, and 91. So the good thing is that we're obviously not going to be purchasing or like adopting a cat as soon as we move into our apartment. So we have more than enough time to save up for any apartment fees and stuff like that. So next is going to be miscellaneous. Miscellaneous is just going to be receiving $5. Um, it's currently empty, so it just has a total of 5 after miscellaneous, we have move out. So move out is going to be getting $10 that were left in food from last week. And it is going to be getting a total of 95. So we have 50, 70, 90, and then $95. I know it's a ton of money for me too, but ew, there's a hair somewhere. Disgusting. So let's go ahead and take out the money that is already in here. These were from a tip that I got from work, which is white in here because it was just kind of extra. So move out now has 50, 70, 90, 100, 105, 110, and 111. So that is super good because this is the first week I've had this envelope and it already has $111 in it. So I couldn't be more thankful again for this whole YouTube thing and you guys. I just, I love you guys and you're such a good community. It's like my favorite thing to do ever. So next is going to be pet needs. They're just going to be getting a dollar. Um, to kind of reference what's been going on today, I may have to even reach into my emergency fund because what they have in here is most likely not enough for what I'm going to need. Um, my pet needs has five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten dollars. So please expect this to be on by next video. So there is ten bucks into pet needs. Then we have school. School's just going to be getting a dollar. I have to rebuild this up because I've been using it to pay for transcripts for the school I hope to transfer to. And I'm going to need like parking permits and a lot of stuff that just goes to school. So we have five, ten, and eleven dollars for now, which is it's okay. I have I have quite a while. So lastly, in this binder at least, we have travel, which is going to be receiving five dollars. So we have twenty, thirty, and thirty-five. So let's stuff this super quickly. And then the last thing we have to stuff is one of my bonus envelopes, which as of right now, I still have them in this pink one. That might change just because these are the only envelopes in here. But we are going to be stuffing Sam's Club, which is back here, and it's going to be getting the last $2. So we have one, two, three, four dollars $4 into Sam's Club, and those bills are super jank. So sorry about that, but there's $4 into Sam's Club. All right, you guys, so I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a big old thumbs up. Sorry that it's late and that the setup and the lighting is just a lot different than what we're used to. But I will see you guys in my next video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And yeah, bye.